Hi friends, hope you are doing great. Today we are going to see this demo. We are going to create retention policy in cloud storage bucket by using the Terraform. In this demo, we are going to see this thing, these things only friends. Okay, let me open the GCP console. So this bucket we have created already friends. But for this demo, we are going to create one more bucket, new bucket we are going to create. So this is a old bucket. Okay. So this is a cloud console. Sorry, this is a cloud shell. So I have already uploaded uh, this file main tf provider uh, then google image also. I am going to open the main.tf file so you can see resource we have specified name, bucket name and location we have given and storage class which we have given ok. Now I am going to use this file only by using this file we are going to create a one more bucket. So I am going to run the terraform command already you know these things terraform init command so it is uh, initializing terraform plan command so now we are going to uh, create one more bucket so terraform apply next is terraform apply okay so we are going to create a bucket inside the bucket object will be uploaded after applying this terraform command okay so you can see friends yes enter a value yes okay now it is creating cloud storage bucket is creating right now and uh, object picture is uploading okay so now you can see friends just click refresh and uh, here uh, terraform bucket may 22 has been uploaded object also it has uploaded so you can see configuration permissions protection so under the protection we have the retention policy so retention policy prevents the deletion or modification of the buckets object for a specified minimum period of time after they are uploaded so once created the retention policy we cannot remove we cannot reduce the time but we can increase the time that's what the retention policy okay so I'm going to uh, just to show that on set retention policy. So if we have the seconds options like seconds, days, months, years. So we can uh, update the duration, entire duration. We can give whatever uh, duration we can give 300 or whatever. So let me uh, open the cloud shell friends. Okay, so let me open the uh, slide here. So retention policy block supports two things is locked and retention period is locked it's optional if you set to true the bucket will be locked and permanently restrict edits to the buckets retention policy next is retention period the period of time in seconds the value must be less than 21474836477 seconds we need to uh, give this uh, value must be uh, less than terraform link also i have given friends so this is the retention policy okay now we are going to use the cloud shell okay we came to the cloud shell here now then I am going to open the BA main.tf file. So inside the file, we are going to update the retention policy. So here we need to insert it. Okay. After the braces here, we need to update retention policy. Retention underscore policy. Retention underscore policy. Open brace. Open brace. Enter. And here space. And here we need to give is underscore locked. Is equal to true next we have to specify retention period retention underscore period here we need to specify the seconds whatever seconds we have to give we can specify uh, seconds okay then close braces now actually here we need to remove the brace and here only we have to uh, put the close braces friends okay then only it will work or else we will get some error so now i am going to save this file terraform file and next we are going to run the terraform commands terraform plan terraform apply commands now i am going to run the terraform plan command after applying this command uh, then we will be getting okay terraform plan there is no retention policy here friends we can check it so i am going to run this terraform plan command so you can see uh, want to change okay now i am going to i am going to run this apply command terraform apply so now the retention policy will be created okay now retention policy will be created friends just go to the console and click refresh here see friends retention policy will be created here okay retention policy created the 300 seconds effective date and the lock status is locked so what i am going to do means next is i am going to uh, we can't we cannot delete also friends okay i am going to edit it so you can see we cannot reduce the time okay you cannot uh, reduce the time but Instead of reducing, I am going to increase. See friends, we can increase. 
okay so we can increase but we cannot decrease or we cannot delete also okay now next thing is what i'm going to do means i will be trying to delete the bucket friends so i'm selecting our bucket and i'm trying to delete uh, we need to type the delete here uh, click delete so before 300 second we cannot delete friends that's what uh, uh, the retention policy will do okay because we have given the 300 seconds right time so before that we cannot do anything in the bucket so we cannot delete so we are getting some uh, message like could not be deleted the bucket could not be deleted okay the same what i am going to do means that's what protection policy which we have specified 300 seconds right retention period and lock status is locked okay so now next thing is i am going to do the same by using the terraform destroy command terraform destroy command here also it will not happen condition is before 300 seconds friends okay terraform destroy i am giving terraform destroy just enter the command now you can see uh, just give yes here and we are getting some error error deleting content of object google image so it is subject to bucket retention policy cannot be deleted overwritten or archived until okay forbidden so uh, that's what friends so before 300 seconds we cannot do anything after 300 seconds only we can delete this bucket that's what the retention policy so again i am going to try this uh, terraform destroy i think uh, 300 seconds crossed i guess so i am going to try this terraform destroy now enter the value as yes and now you can see friends destroy okay so now you can refresh in console definitely the bucket will be gone terraform bucket may 22 22 it will be gone okay friends we have successfully completed this demo you can also try from your end thank you so much friends thank you so much you can uh, i will update the slide in the description okay thank you so much have a great day bye bye